Hey YouTube, it's Dano. Hey, we're having a giveaway tonight. Uh, it's going to be on Jammy Time. Michelle, just playing, uh, is uh, the sponsor of the channel, and a lot of a lot of friends and other preppers on that channel. You got to check them out. Um, we're doing it tonight. We're going to give this away. Uh, I'm a treasure hunter. I do a lot of metal detecting too. And about 10 years ago, I was doing an old house hunt, an abandoned house, and out in the shed, wrapped in burlap, I found this old Boy Scouts of America official first aid kit and it was full somebody hid it in 1957 uh, I'd been hid there since 1957 when I found it the reason I know is because when I opened it up it was full of wheat backs mostly wheat backs uh, wheat back pennies and uh, the newest one was 1957 uh, there's been a couple coins made their way into here since then you know but it, it's almost all 1957 and older um, it's got a little bit of everything <laughs> I've got a here's a what it is that? That's a laser tag coin, like a Chuck E. Cheese game token. You know, it might still work. Uh, got an old buffaloes in there. I pulled some of these out to check the dates. A couple old buffaloes. Uh, a lot of a lot of steel war pennies. Um, let's see. There's a 1944 Merc Mercury dime. That's going to be in there. And uh, out of the steel pennies, this one's always confused me. These are both 1943 steel pennies, but this one, this is what most of them look like, the, the dark one. This one has never tarnished, and it's been in this box since 1957 or earlier. Is it made out of stainless? I, this has always pub, puzzled me. It looks like it came out of the mint yesterday. Real, real oddball. Uh, there's another uh, 1956 wheat that same thing it never tarnished uh, did they make it out of a different metal alloy or something that year I don't know and the oldest one is a 1859 Indian uh, it's in decent shape um, no there's no fortune to be found in here when I originally found I went through and cataloged all the coins and there I sold off a couple that were worth a lot of money there was a I had a couple I think it were 1909 S's or P's or something that I got a decent amount on eBay for and the other thing that was in here is a World War II Africa Corps. I researched this. This would have only been used for the African troops of the German army. And it was originally plated in silver. I think it's either uh, it's an alloy. It might be copper. I'm not sure. Pretty cool piece. Um, still got the little tabs on there. Um, but that, was, uh, that would have been on like one of those uh, pith helmets, like those safari helmets. Uh, but uh, this is getting away. It's a... Uh, Got the original belt loops on it. it. This whole box weighs three pounds, 15 ounces. So, a little bit of treasure. If you got a kid that's filling a coin book, they'll have a blast with this. Uh, if not, in a, a SHTF situation, you got over three pounds of copper here. But we're giving away tonight, so I'll put some links on there for jammy time. And you got to come check us out. Uh, we'll have a blast. We always do. And uh, not sure exactly how we're going to pick the winner, but we'll figure it out. So you guys show up and have a blast. Have a good one.